Hello and welcome back to Your Grounded. This is the first of the armor sets we're going to be breaking down in build 0.2.2.2335 of the game. I work crazy hard on these videos so please do give it a thumbs up rating if you learned something new that you didn't know before. It only takes 5 seconds of your time and it's massively helpful to me. All the testing for my videos as normal is done on the WoW difficulty unless stated otherwise. Now let's take a look at the Clover armor set. First off we'll be looking at the armor rating and how much damage resistance you get from something like a heavy hitting attack from the Orb Weaver, something like the one handed strike. Here you can see that I've created what I call a damage ruler. It's essentially 25 segments that make up 100% of the whole. You can then find out how much percent is missing based off the segments as each segment is 4%. Uh, of course 100% divided by 25 segments is 4. Here you can see that an unarmored one-handed strike deals about 76% of our maximum health as damage. We can tell this because 19 segments are missing, 19 times 4 is 76. Now if we switch over to a full set of clover armor and take a hit from the same animation, we now take 64% of our maximum health as damage using the previously mentioned math. This means that we've taken 11% less damage since putting the clover set on. Not that great, but what can you expect from a few leaps? Now for the set bonus. This one's called Moist and it states that you're squishy and you retain water well. I've tested the you're squishy part and I could only think of either reduced damage resistance, but this makes no sense because the armor actually gives you armor, so what would be the point of taking it away again? Or reduced fall damage. This isn't the case because as you can see in the background, armor and its total armor value reduces the fall damage as well as battle damage, so there's no way to actually test that. I'm assuming this is just done for descriptive purposes. Uh, the clip on the far left is the full spider set, which has the highest armor rating. The clip in the middle is the clover set, and the clip on the right is completely unarmored. Now for the retains water well portion of this bonus. After generating gigs upon gigs of footage of me just standing still to test how fast the water bar drains, I've come up with these results. So without a clover set on, the water bar drains in 15 minutes and 12 seconds. With the clover set on, you're looking at 16 minutes and 20 seconds before coming up dry. This is an extension of around 8.5%, but because I'm not perfect, I'm going to assume that this was a small error made somewhere and that the real saving is somewhere around the 10% margin. Now onto the perk bonuses for the clover pieces. Each perk is called plus fuller and the description merely states that you stay fuller longer. Again about another 20 gig of 1440p footage later and we have these findings. A small note beforehand is that if you stand still only your water bar will drain. I stood still for in excess of 20 minutes and my hunger was still tip top with and without the clover set on. Therefore I had to find an easy and consistent way to burn the hunger bar and I came up with swinging a weapon. Here you can see that without the full clover set on, which is the clip on the left, we could swing our mint mallet up to 85 times before the penultimate hunger warning appeared. The final hunger warning appeared at the 100th swing exactly. In the clip on the right with the full set on, we can see that the penultimate hunger warning appears at 100 swings exactly and the final warning appears at 117 swings. Once again I'm going to assume that this was human error and that the final warning is actually 115 swings due to the solidarity of the previous data that we collected. So with all this data in mind, we can conclude that the Clover Armor set increases your maximum thirst by 10% and your maximum hunger by 15%. Thank you ever so much for watching and if this video impressed you, please leave a rating before you head back into the garden. Thanks again and take care guys.